Hi. Okay. So if, as you can see, May and June, we have so many different things happening and I'm sure that I'm missing some of it. Um, I think you've all gotten the message at this point, but today we're doing blocks four, five, and six. And this is because there is no school tomorrow on Friday the 10th. It's a faculty academy day. And so we need to have four, five, and six meet again so that we can finish up testing for ELA. Um, and so the 10th, no school. Um, next week, we're looking forward to sixth graders going on a field trip to the California Science Center with school buses. Um, on the 14th, that's a Tuesday, promotion speeches are due. So for eighth graders, this is one of your last calls for promotion speeches. Um, and, and there's other dates related to that. On the 21st, not next week, but the week after, we have a student leader training because that Friday there is a beach day event. Um, and I will accept student leaders who have forgotten to sign up by today, Thursday, May 9th. Um, on the 27th, it's Memorial Day, no school. Um, and 30th, actually it's the 31st, is the final day for late assignments. So the last day in May is the last day for late assignments. Let's look at some details here. Um, okay, the Friday the 31st, very last day. Eighth graders, you're going to Pally Camp that last week. So really you need to look at Friday, May 24th as your last day for late assignments. Um, one detail in case any of you have not heard, the Baxters are off limits for students. It is only very occasionally that a staff member will take a student down the back stairs, but you cannot go down the back stairs on your own or it's a lunch reflection. Um, and then there's a choir performance, not this week or the next week, but the week after that, May 23rd. And so talk in your advisory group whether you're planning on going to that. There's a lot of performances coming up. Um, the green team is very active. They meet on Tuesdays at lunch and right after school, and they want you to join. Um, and then just a reminder, a visual reminder, the Google form is due if you want to be a student leader for the beach day. Um, and that is on school announcements. Yearbooks, you can still order. Jazz Angels, I still think you can join. The talent show, there's been a date change. So we have a handful of students who've signed up to do the talent show, but not enough to have us use the large chapel space. So what we've done instead is we've created a talent show assembly schedule on Friday, May 24th. We're going to have a very long lunch because we're in the rec center going to have um, all the talent show. It'll... Um, It'll be like students coming in, um, and if you don't want to go to the talent show, then you'll just be at lunch, um, and there won't be ins and outs. So we'll figure out those details, but that is something else to look forward to Friday, May 24th, cross country. I'm glad all of you are running. Um, and then next week, science test for eighth graders, and that will be in your science classes. We will do some pullouts for anyone that still has your ELA makeup tests, and then the week of the 20th through the 24th, we return with state testing in your math class for your math tests. So here we go, June. Last day of school is June 13th. I put out a whole different announcement about the details for the last day of school. Um, and promotion information for those of you that are interested in going. As 6th and 7th graders, you have to have a chaperone. And 8th graders, it is your day. I'm looking forward to it. Um, and then just looking further in the summer, there's um, orientation in August. And I hope that a lot of you will join. We have really fun and sweet incoming 5th graders to 6th grade. Um, and many of you have signed up for classes at LBCC. There's a lot of classes available, whether they are for credit or just fun summer classes. So don't miss out on that. All the information is in um, Parent Square, and your parents can look it up. Okay, so our virtue ceremony will not be next week, but the week after, and we'll have a choir performance then. I hope you all have a wonderful Thursday. There is, actually, let me go back to the first slide. There is very few advisories left. Sixth and seventh graders, including today, you have six advisories left. Um, and eighth graders, you only have four because you'll be at Pally Camp. So thank you for going to four, five, six classes today. Next week, we go to four, five, six classes again. We're just on the rotating schedule. This was the only strange, weird week. Thank you for being willing and flexible to make adjustments. Hope you have a great day.